All right, now to a surprise twist today in the Samantha Wall murder trial. The jury says it remains deadlocked, but now the composition of that jury is about to change. That'll happen tomorrow. Sean Lay following this trial for us. Sean, an alternate juror now being moved in place. And this is another wild twist, Devin. I want to catch everyone up. There's so much interest in this trial and so much interest that the jury has not come back with any verdict yet. And now we know because a juror had a pre-scheduled vacation late today that she's leaving on vacation tomorrow. She was released from this juror and an alternate is now in place. Two more alternates could be in line for that tomorrow. I caught up with the defense attorneys for Jackson Bolanos, Michael Jackson Bolanos, to ask them how they're feeling about all this. This is taking a long time, and what's your reaction to that? I am shocked. I feel like it should not be taking this long. It should be pretty quick to come back on a not guilty because he's not guilty and they can't prove the elements. I just spoke with co-counsel defending Michael Jackson Bolanos, Perna Krishnamurthy, and lead counsel Brian Brown moments after yet another bizarre day of jury deliberations in this trial. Michael Jackson Bolanos facing life in prison. Samantha Bull's life was taken in a horrifically violent way last October 21st, and still no verdict from this jury. In fact, one juror was released today and replaced. She has vacation that starts tomorrow. Wool's family still waiting. Jackson Bolanos still waiting. He's feeling like he's in limbo, which is not a great feeling for anyone. Late today, the jury told the judge it remains deadlocked on some of the charges, and three jurors have conflicts tomorrow. One juror excused for that pre-planned vacation. Another has a doctor's appointment tomorrow afternoon, and another juror is working out a child care issue. Bottom line, Jackson Bolanos' attorney, Brian Brown, wants that alternate juror's voice in that deadlocked room tomorrow. I believe that it hopefully should shake things up and, um, you know, a, a fresh voice to get to the, you know, to the root of the problem. All right, so quickly, let's review full day of deliberations last Wednesday, full day of deliberations on Friday, full day today of deliberations. No verdict. The judge was uh, got a note from the jury indicating they remain deadlocked. She said, let's give it one more try tomorrow. Devin? Sean, deadlocked on all charges, or do we know that? You know, that's a good question, and the attorneys we're speaking to, sources we're speaking to, no one knows what's happening inside that room, but right. they are have vindicated to the judge that they have reached a verdict on one or two of the charges, and another one may be tripping them up and delaying this. So mm. do they reach a verdict on first-degree murder or uh, home invasion or lying to police? That's unknown right now. And what will the new face on that jury mean to all of those deliberations? All right, Sean.